Welcome back guys. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I am Mr. Right Way and today I'm going to talk about five ways just like Booker T said. On the five time, five time, five time, five time, five time. Five reasons why GameStop is great for the gaming community. Now I've seen all these videos on YouTube Talking about how much I hate GameStop. GameStop did this. GameStop did that. Crying. Right? You can't stop hurting my feelings. Oh, I hate GameStop. Stop. Stop right now. But don't go nowhere. Because this is, I'm telling you, this is going to benefit you also in the end. It's five ways why it benefits the community. So, let's get into it. First, and the best, I think number one, is use games. Used games, man, used games are great right now at GameStop. Don't get me wrong, mom and pop stores have great good used games. Like I said in my previous video, pawn shops have tremendous used games, but you don't know what you're going to get. So you can actually get on your phone, go to the GameStop app, scroll, and look for video games. Simple as that, just like you do on any other app. But still, it's, it's great by GameStop because you can look by your district. So look at these games that I got right here. Look at these used games. Shantae on the Wii U, complete. Now, yes, it's new, but I shrunk wrapped this because I wanted to keep it, you know, pristine. Because I got Shantae everywhere on Vita, on PlayStation 3, Switch, so. I have this game, but great used games. Let me show you some other great used games that you can find at GameStop. Completely cheap. This one blew my mind when I found it a couple months ago. It was Dead Rising 2. Complete. I'm talking about fully complete, guys. I'm going to show you real quick. We're going to talk about fully complete. Look, it had the little pen that came with that, right? It had the art book. Yeah, I'm getting so much stuff is up here. Unused, right? I guess this is a map or a book or something. But it says Zumrex. This is. But it's, it's wild. I don't know why that's bent like that. I don't know if it came like that. But that's, that's how it was, right? And also, too, you have. <laughs> well, I even know a notepad was in there. That's pretty cool. A notepad for Zumrex. So if you get. The outbreak, you know, hey, what's this now? Yeah, same thing. And then also, look at that. The Zombrex. Look at that. Check that out. That's why you always ask and say, hey, what kind of uh, deals do you have? What kind of uh, special edition do you have in your drawer for cheap? I always ask that the game stuff. That is good for the community because, you know, if I bought this at a local video game store, they're probably going to charge me a little bit more than what GameStop has this all right for. Now, the price on it is going to pop on the screen. That's the price for it right now. They don't differ from either Xbox 360, Special Edition, or regular. They just knocked it all down to this, so you still can find it. Please get it. Another one, too, was... Marvel vs. Capcom 3 Special Edition. As you see, I got a thing for Special Editions. And this is crazy. This right here, I think, will top those two tremendously. Resident Evil 4. Now you're saying, what? Resident Evil 4? Nah. <laughs> Let me show you. The Steelbook Edition for PlayStation 2. Yes. It is complete with the art and everything. Still, but for PlayStation 2, how hard it is to find that out there. Perfect. Look at that. All right, so there you go. Number two, free stuff. When I'm talking about free stuff, I'm talking about things that decorate your gaming room. So, as you can see, this right, this right here, 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 and I look ridiculous. What's free? What's free? Totally free, yo. Did I pre-order this? 
Nah, they didn't even pre order. They had extra. So they gave it to me. Super free. Let's put my very cheap glasses on now. Another thing that was free. Wait for it. Wait for it. Boom! Look at that. What's up, Luigi? How you doing? That was free. All I had to do was ask a month ahead of time, and they put my name on it. They put some respect on Luigi's name. They had put my name on it first, but they put it on his first. Or however that goes. But you, as you see, I got something free. I can put this in my game room, which is running out of room right now. But you get the point. You get something. This, this is cool. I mean, who doesn't love Luigi? Who doesn't love him? I love him. It's a little scary, but... Alright, time to go to sleep, Luigi. Number three. Being a pro member. Ho oh, ho! Right now, that's kind of a sensitive subject, right? I understand. The old way of being a pro member is taken away. Hopefully, they can work that out by next year. But, until it happens, you still got a pro membership. You know what I'm talking about. Discounts on games. 10% off. That's amazing. 10% off of used games. Just like I said, with this right here, Shantae, and even Resident Evil, I got 10% off both of these. And they were used. On top of that, being a pro member, sometimes they have excellent deals on trade-ins. Now, you know GameStop trade-ins are like, ugh, yeah. Sometimes they can just be not too great. But on pro days, doing pro week, mm, five, there you go that five again. On the five time, five time, five time, five time, five time, WCW champion. Now can you dig that? Five extra dollars towards trading. Uh -huh. Do you know what that can do? Any game under $2.50, that means you can build a whole collection. That's how I build my Wii U collection. The first one. Go back and look at that video. Some helpful tips in there. Go look it up. Share it with your friends. You can do this with GameStop. Number four. Woo! 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 Shipping the store. Now, this is a little secret that a lot of people don't know about or don't take advantage of. Now, say you need a game for your collection. Always with. So I got three games right here on the PlayStation Vita. Right here. Now, you know GameStop, now guys. If you're watching this video, sometimes it's a hit and miss. Sometimes it's like, all right, I got the case and the manual and the game all in one. Sometimes, not so much. But if you have empty boxes laying around and you want a box fill, one, go to the website, order a game, get it shipped to your store or shipped to your house. Two, go in GameStop and say, hey, I'm looking for this game right here. They will say, well, what zip code are you living in? Pick many zip codes. And you know some zip code where your friends at? Hey, see where my friend is. See? And they'll look and it says, boom. Or number three, have them call corp have them email corporate in about a couple more days corporate is going to send them a list of zip codes and numbers where you can get the game that you're looking for how cool is that if GameStop leaves you can't do that already you st I'm stuck here in Dallas and I want a game in New York City New York City New York City stranger I hope you can be the full house sitting here in Dallas right and I want a game in how to say SCU All the way in Southern California Let me tell you They can get it if it's in there And number five The best and most important reason 
to my heart. This is this means so much to me because what you see is I put this tweet up. GameStop saying right here, to paraphrase, they're giving all active military retired. You serve in the Navy, Army, Marines, Air Force, Coast Guard. You have a military ID. Guess what? You get 10% off. That means 10% off of you, 10% off of you. Yeah, even 10% off of the Marines because I'm a Navy guy. <laughs> but that's right. Yes, I served. I got hurt in the military. I'm a retiree. I'm a Navy veteran. All I had to do is go in my game stop and say, hey, I need to get that 10%. Can I please get that? They put that code in. Bam, 10% off it. It's just like being a pro member. How cool is that? So that's five reasons I gave you why GameStop is good for the gaming community. Say that three times fast. Like the, like the old adage says, rising tides raise all ships. And this ship is GameStop. If GameStop went away, I don't know what happened, guys. I mean, Amazon is not doing that prices no more. Best Buy program is gone. You know, Walmart is horrible but they're still doing an okay job with like ten dollar list games for the switch sometimes you know it's a hit or miss you don't want to have to wait all year to black friday just to get a deal on a game right you want to walk into a store where somebody actually knows what they're talking about now some games some people don't know what they're talking about but you as a gamer can educate them you're going into a community you this is our community gamestop belongs to us why do we want to see it uh, leave? Why do we want to see people lose their jobs? Now, let me get something straight. I have had some horrible experience with GameStop. But you know what? Those people don't know how to work with other folks. This is how the world is. So, GameStop is not bad. GameStop is amazing, guys. GameStop is the best place to buy video games. Now, Amazon, yes, I know you some said, what, what about Amazon? Amazon is great. Amazon is good. But try buying our used games off Amazon. Yeah. I know some of y'all watching that had some bad experiences about that, right? Can't stop be some all. Because you can actually go in there and say, hey, I need this game. I always can go back to these. I need Blaze Blue, right? Well, I already got the case. Now I need the game. Boom. Found it. It's filled, it's ready to go. Well, there you have it, guys. I'm so happy that you watched this video. Thank you for hitting that like and subscribe button. Thank you for sharing this video with all your friends. And any of the ones who hate GameStop, share it with them too. Because it's Christmas time. Well, not yet, but it almost feels like it, don't it? You know? That's another video for another time. But thank y'all so much for watching this video. If you need anything, and talk about stuff, holler at me in the comments. I'm right here below. I will be there. I'll always be there trying to answer each and every one of your uh, questions. So once again, thank you so much for watching this video. One more time, hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification on the, that bell right there. And always remember, you got to keep doing it the right way. Take care.